Hey guys, it's Kat and the girls, and today we are going to go on that, what everybody else is doing, the churros from Disneyland. So, we got our ingredients together, and I'll put the link down at the bottom. So what you need, apparently, is uh, one cup of water, eight tablespoons of butter, three eggs, a quarter teaspoon of salt, half a cup of sugar, and then it says three quarter teaspoons of cinnamon divided, so I got a half a teaspoon, and I'm just going to divide it like that and then one and a quarter cup of flour and then if you have a piping bag which I do not but I have this so I kinda make it do and then it calls for uh, one and a half cups of vegetable or canola oil I just got canola oil I'm gonna, can you stop eating the sugar? Why? because it's for the recipe but it's good yeah okay so let's start with what they say Okay, please, please stop it. Okay. Number one, combine water, butter, salt, and a quarter teaspoon of cinnamon in one and a half quart saucepan. Okay, let's get a saucepan. Whoa. Okay, so it says water. Water. So water. What else does it say? Butter, salt. Okay, so then it says a quarter teaspoon. Excuse me. Can you stop touching the sugar? That would be awesome. Delicious. So, quarter teaspoon salt. <laughs> quarter teaspoon salt. Then it says quarter teaspoon cinnamon. anymore so I think we need to mix it here I don't know if you'd call that a roiling boil yet but Okay, so we've reduced it to low, and then what? 
Okay, reduce to low. Add flour and stir oh, vigorously hi. until mix forms to a ball. Flour. Okay, I gotta, I gotta boil. Whoop! Stuff's not even butter's not even melted yet. So I'm assuming I gotta do this until that bowl, bleh, 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 butter's boiled. What? Smells like churros. 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 Okay, so mm. it's like all the butter coffee. is melted. It so now like we're gonna put it to low. Mm. We're gonna add our flour and stir vigorously, it says. Okay. So, this is what it looks like. Now, what do we do? You guys can't see that. Add one egg. Add flour, stir vigorously until mix forms a ball. Remove from heat and let rest for five to seven minutes. So, do that. We're gonna set our timer for five minutes. We'll do it for six since it said five to seven. And then we'll come back and add the egg. Okay, I don't know if I was recording this last time, but I put my three eggs in. It's stirred and vigorously. And I finally got the consistency. I got my oil going. And I'm messy as can be, and my kids have left. Mine are going to be little chin, teeny tiny churritos. I'm sure all you bakers out there right now are cringing at my piping skills. Yes, do that and... So you have to really do that? Yeah, is it spraying you? I'd stay away a little bit if it's spraying you. Yeah, you gotta cook them in the oil. And then we toss them into the cinnamon and brown sugar. You don't have much but some. My camera? Yeah, I do have much. Yeah, and I charge the battery too, so I don't know. It smells. It smells oh. like what? It smells. Cinnamony, at least I hope. It smells kind of good. Well, it's oil, so it's gonna smell weird. Make it a mess. Oh yeah.
Okay, so I think the last batch is the one that um, kind of worked out the best. The bottom ones are a little brown. Thanks, Willow. Okay, so we're going to try them. This will be the first attempt. Oh, my goodness. What they taste like. Okay, go. I'm going to pick a sugary one. I think if they were bigger, if I had a bigger pipe thingy, they would have been better, but <laughs> I guess you really can't go wrong with sugar and cinnamon. No. That one's crunchy. Yeah, that one's probably one of the burnt ones. Mm. Yeah, that one's pretty good. Well, I don't know. I think it's because mine were so thin. They're not as good as Disneyland, but I think if you want a treat, you can't really go wrong. They're pretty simple. Okay. Well, I guess we'll see you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.